that it's time to cut, stack, and roll. We're talking about spring rolls today. How you can stuff them with anything under the sun and showing us how to do it is the STL Veg Girl, Karen Dugan. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, this is gonna be fun today. Oh, I'm excited. Yeah. I mean, I love spring rolls. So when I saw you were coming and making this, my heart got so happy. And you love these too. I do. You know what? I love to play with my food, right? <laughs> you know, everything your parents said don't do, do. as a kid. We like to do. <laughs> yeah. And also, you know what? This is also a great way to get your kids or anybody in your family mm -hmm. to try or to put more plants on their plate without nice. having like copious amounts of it and saying, mm -hmm. finish your plate or finish do your, this, you know. Do that. Yeah. So what we're going to do here is we're going to take this rice paper. If you okay. Take one. You want to come with <gasps> um, me? Yes. Take that. I have a question. I'm looking at the different colors of these rice paper. Yes. What's the difference? This so, one's a little bit browner. This yeah. Is so square, that, that's circular. That's brown rice. Oh. This is a white rice. Okay. And these are both white rice. Okay. They're just different shapes. So what you're going to do is you're going to make it really pliable by putting it in warm water and just kind of feel it. Mm hmm for like mm, 15, 10, 15, 20 seconds or so mm. until it's pliable enough to where it's not breaking, but okay. it's not like super thin where you're ripping it. Okay. It takes a little bit of time. I see. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> kind of slippery now. Uh-huh. Wait, okay. it might be. I think that is you it might good? be You think fine. it's ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead. Take so this out. is this is a great recipe also, or a great fun thing to do with the family. Turn off the oven, right? Mm -hmm. Turn get off your, that stove. Get top. your hands ready. Get these fresh veggies in. Right. Okay. So I'm gonna go for some carrots. What you want to do is put your put your ingredients mm -hmm. down to like the first third of of the rice paper. Okay. Okay. And we want to lay these out also on a non-porous surface. Okay. Because if you if you put them down like say on a like a, a wood cutting board or something, mm -hmm. that water will just and, and we this will just that. soak up, right? And it'll just okay. adhere to it. Yeah. So, you know, a little bit of tofu, get your family involved with tofu, some greens maybe that they wouldn't try, maybe some bok choy. Okay. I'm or gonna, a little bit of cabbage. How do you know when it's too full? Or is that is that uh, you'll know. Possible? You'll okay. know. <laughs> she said you will know. Now we're just going to wrap this. We're gonna push, we're gonna do one roll, make okay. sure it sticks there, right? Roll, roll, roll. And I've I've been on here for a while, so it may not do what I want it to do. And then just like a burrito, mm -hmm. put your Oh, your you make that look in. so easy. Well, I mean, you mine are not it. that pretty. Okay. But. Well, you know, it doesn't matter. Pretty is just showing up the way you are. And that's that's showing up the way it is, you know? <laughs> and then place it on either parchment paper or wax paper. Okay. Is mine too full? Well, I'll, I'll, let, it, uh -oh. I'll let it tell you. Let's see. It's telling me, it's saying, ooh, girl, you're too thick. I don't know, maybe not though. Maybe, maybe not? not? Okay, let's see. There you go, there you okay. go, let it stick. Uh-huh, there you go, you got it. Thank you, thank you. Okay. You know. It's okay. It does take patience, and you've got it. You've got, there you go. There you wow, go. she's not too thick. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> you know what, I'm, I'm impressed. That is a big boy right there. Thank you. That I, is a big boy. I think it looks pretty perfect. <laughs> Okay, now everybody knows these spring rolls are oh so good when you have something to dip them in. Mm -hmm. What are we dipping in today? We have a rice uh, rice vinegar okay. and some heat in there. Ooh, you, you got the cayenne? You know me so is, well. This is a peanut sauce, <laughs> I do, with some crushed peanuts on top. Ooh, nice. So either one. Okay, and you've made all this from scratch. The, yes. Shall I taste? Yes, yes, I would love for you I'm gonna to make taste a mess it. though. No, no, no. So you're getting your delicious greens in there and some fresh veggies. This is all raw. I'm so okay. proud of you. Thank you. I'm, I'm proud. So I'm proud of you too. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. And this is, again, it's a great way to try new veggies mm -hmm. without having to, you know, finish a whole plate or something, right? Which is nice. Yeah. I mean, it's great. That's a win in my book. So fresh, uh -huh. flavorful. Mm -hmm. Got a piece of tofu in there. That's right. Should have put some avocado in there. Well, I love the avocado. next, the next one, mm -hmm. and um, so and really, bell peppers, mushrooms, carrots. You know, these we have some um, mint over here, Ooh. and then also some Thai basil. So oh, if you put honey. that down, for, whatever you put down first mm -hmm. is going to show up on the outside. Okay. And it can be. You can even put edible flowers in there. <gasps> So now that's neat. So well, I clearly put down my carrots first, Look my at cabbage. That. It's gorgeous. I, I think I did a good job. It's gorgeous. I like it. 
Okay, this is the perfect way to get your family involved. And we're going to make a couple more when we come back. But first, we're going to get you up to date and caught up on your news headlines. We're seeing the things inside of our studio with news anchor Amelia McGavero.